being part of the first chatting episode. Oh, I knew you would do it. I knew it. No big deal. Oh, oh, your puppies are fighting. Oh no, they're just loving on each other. Hey, 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 calm down. Calm down. <laughs> Ariel, no up, please. That's great. <laughs> so, uh, girl, so basically, since I haven't seen you since we've been laid off. Um, temporarily. Just, temporarily, yes. That's true. I do miss you guys. I miss laughing. I do miss you guys too. I know. I miss our at good six time. In the morning. I know. Very well, delirious. Like six thirty in the morning. <laughs> so fun fact. Um, Angela, Angela and I are not very punctual. Can I say that? Is that okay? <laughs> <laughs> That's what I was gonna ask you. Like, what can we say? And what can we not say? Uh, I mean, I mean, who isn't punctual? towards it like starting from losing the job or, or temporarily okay so like the last weekend that I worked at the hotel at that point that, that, that's when we had started using like all this Germex and we were like cleaning our stuff and everything and I was kind of scared and then like some guests would be like oh we just came why would you wait you're frozen I'm not I'm concerned can you right hear me yeah, oh, you froze too, but I was like, keep going, keep going. Okay, okay. Um, and they're like, oh, we're gonna give you the virus, and I was like, that's not fun to joke about, you know. Yeah. Um, so I was kind of scared to come back the next weekend, but then, um, I don't know if we're saying names. Can we say names? If you want. My to, manager yeah. called yeah, me and said that she was gonna take me off for this next two weekends, and I was like, you know what? That's all good. I I'm kind of scared to go back. So, because, yeah, I mean, like, our job is kind of, you know, we don't know where people are coming from. And um, I just hope our coworkers who are over there are actually working are safe. Yeah, I'm sure they are. But it's true, because um, we will deal with a lot of people from the airport, from the army, from randos, from EP, <laughs> like, from everywhere. It's true. And yeah. it, it was pretty scary. But it sucked, because... Everything happened so fast, and I'm like, boom. I'm like, Angela's not coming to work for two weeks. I was like, what? And that was the last two weeks I worked. So I was like, okay, but oh. I didn't think, I didn't think it would hit us so fast, or I didn't even think anything of it when it was happening in China. So I don't know if yeah, Regina, I didn't think it was gonna get over here. You know, I didn't think it would reach us. So us fast. exactly, yeah. or even reach us at all. Like that's how naive I am. I'm like, yeah, whatever. It's not gonna ever yeah. get here. I guess I always feel like we're, like, in our little bubble, but we're not. Yeah, exactly. So, in the midst of all that, like, what were you doing um, when you were laid off? Well, I was enjoying the time off because, girl, I hadn't had, like, so much time off in such a long time. Like, I felt like I was constantly going. I think I even told you, like, while we were working, I felt like I was so tired of everything it was either school or work, school or work, like, I hardly ever had any days off, so then to suddenly get, like, two weeks completely, because it was, like, the the weeks that we went on spring break for school as well, so I, I literally had nothing to do for, like, two weeks, Yeah. so I painted, I started sewing, kind of, then I made some jewelry, then I painted some other stuff, and I cleaned my room, I caught up with my laundry, which never, ever happened, <laughs> yeah, um, all sorts of weird things, you know, 
I um I grew out my leg hair so I could wax it. <laughs> positive mentality during all this because we don't know when it's gonna end really no um I'm not being very hard on myself that way I don't get sad because there was like a point maybe like last week or two weeks ago when I was like dude like you're not doing anything and I was I would be like you're so lazy and blah 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 and then I would be sad about that I'd be like oh no I'm wasting all this time but now I'm just like yesterday I said oh it's Monday the beginning of a new week I'm gonna, I don't know, because I had spent the weekend, like, kind of stressing about some stuff that I had to do for work, for school, um, so I didn't really have a weekend, so I decided yesterday was gonna be, like, a day off, I, I was gonna clean my room, but then that ended up not happening, because I came outside to my, my porch, and I was like, oh, it's such a nice day, so I hung out there, sang a little bit, then I decided to take out my violin, which I haven't played in, like, a whole year or so, and so I spent like hours, Judith, outside just playing the awesome. violin. My poor neighbors. Um, <laughs> yeah, and I had it was a nice, just nice, relaxing day outside. And so I'm just letting days like that. I'm just enjoying them, and I'm like, you know what? I can get whatever work done tomorrow. Today was supposed to be the day that I'm getting work done. I haven't really done much, but I mean, I've kind of been. You you made me get up early. You made me put on some pants. <laughs> I made you get up early I, for nothing. <laughs> It wasn't even early, really. You okay. know what time I woke up at? I woke up at like 12, 12.57. Girl, and I woke I was up like, at one forty-seven. Oh, I'm like, oh, shit. <laughs> That's hilarious. Yeah. Oh, well. Mm-hmm. So then you basically... Did I answer the question? You did, yeah. You did. Okay. <laughs> but you've been singing... Have you been singing more, too, as well? Because you're always um, singing, right? I'm always singing. There was a few days when I wasn't singing. I was like, wow, I haven't sang in a long time. So I'm trying to um, get back to that. Like the first week of quarantine, I was singing a heck of a lot because we're in here. Look, this is my cuffy, but I'm going to show you guys. Um, oh no, my bad! Let me just plug in my cuffy. Oh no, okay. Um, how do I, how do I do this? Look, can you hear it? Yeah. <laughs> this is like the worst thing ever. Like, anyway, that was too fast. I'm sure you couldn't see anything. I saw, I saw it. Okay. My one sister. I have two sisters, but only my one sister painted. Anyway. <laughs> oh, so we were in here painting, and this place has, like, awesome, awesome echoey things. So yeah. we, were, we were, like, constantly singing as we were, um, as we were painting. And I was like, hey! I don't know. It was just awesome, and I felt like I was practicing, and I was, like, I'm work, trying to work on my range and stuff, and so it's yeah. been awesome fun. But then... I kind of stopped singing for a little bit, and I feel like I get rusty after I stop singing. So now I'm trying to get back into that, trying to warm up some more. And what was your question? <laughs> you did answer. You're answering it right now. <laughs> yeah, just basically, what have you been doing, like, to keep a positive mindset and everything? Oh like yeah, that? <laughs> playing my playing my piano, my keyboard, oh, and not a piano. Yeah, I tried writing some stuff yesterday, writing some music. Um, yeah, I don't, I don't, it's like a lot of things, random things, and it'll, it'll come yeah. to my head later, but they can't come to my head now. And painting. Yeah, that's awesome. Google and some stuff, yeah. You did um say some good points, because a lot of people do take themselves so seriously, and they shouldn't, and they yeah. should just enjoy life, and go with the flow, and move, and 
create Dude, if you I got want that to. From you. <laughs> you. I love did. that you say that. I did. Aww. Yes. Like when you would say like, oh, it's no big deal. Like when we were at work, I was like, you're right. It's not. Like, it really isn't. Why do yeah. we stri- Yeah. And it's okay. and honestly, girl, I used to not be like that. I used to always be stressed and I used to always be so hard on myself. And um and I would take things so personal. And now that I I guess I've done the inner work and I'm still working on myself, don't get me wrong, but it's just like, don't take it so serious. It's not a big deal. It really isn't. It just isn't. I love that you that you say that. I love it. But um, and um, you, what are you focusing on? Are you writing more? Or are you? So it's it's pretty much the same, honestly. I'm pretty random as well. So I'm like, yeah, oh, I'm gonna do this, and like, I'm gonna do that, and and like, this is one of it. I'm so happy you did it. Like at first, I didn't want. I wanted to do this so bad. But then I was like, nah, because then I started thinking, overthinking it. I was like, you know what? Just do it. If it doesn't work out, then it doesn't work out. But it's working out. But yeah, I've been doing the same. I want to practice my singing, too. I'm not that great of a singer like you, but I want to practice, too. But then I have neighbors. I have neighbors who can hear me. That's horrible. I have neighbors, too. And I kind of feel bad for them sometimes. Because, you know, I'm trying to work, like, on, like, the, like, not, is it called belting? I should know the question. Something like that. So, so I'm like singing my head off over here and my poor neighbors. Um, Girl, you have a nice voice. I like your voice. Peace. Thank you. Ah. But sometimes, thank you. Thank you. Like when I'm trying to get up to notes that I, that are not really easily in my range and my voice goes and breaks on me and I'm like, ah, yeah. I'm sorry. But that's but. awesome that you're doing that because you're practicing and you're going to get there, you know. Nick Jonas on The Voice said that. <laughs> really good he's all like i don't know what tone he sings but he sings a high tone i forgot the uh-huh. name but he's all i never sang that tone until i practice and now i sing it all the time that's what he said on the voice i don't know yeah i've so noticed like, over like maybe in this past year that i have gotten like higher notes and i'm like oh i never thought that i could hit them and yeah it's totally doable i thought i thought you were kind of just stuck with whatever you were like i don't know whatever you could just naturally sing and no you can just always work on it so that's, That's why so if you true. want to work on singing, work on your singing, girl, yeah. Practice does make perfect, I guess. No, practice does do something for you, I guess. Yeah. It does, right? Yeah. Yeah. yeah it does. <laughs> like, what are we trying to say? So then, the last question, how has this changed your life, your entire life, you feel? Just being quarantined at home, um, being with your uh, family, <laughs> being more with yourself, obviously. Yeah, it's a lot of being with myself. It's a lot of my thoughts in my mm-hmm. head, which some of them I've tried to write down. I have this. I'm going to show you. I even have it here. I have my lovely notebook that was That's gifted awesome. to me for my birthday, and I write lots of stuff in it. Um, most of them are thoughts, just like whatever's going on in my head that day, like super long stuff. Mm-hmm. Um, and I figure like, Later, if I'm wanting to write about I don't know what and I don't know what to write about, I can go back and read on what I was thinking and and use my thoughts. I don't know. Um, yeah. So it's changed me like that. I've had time to, I don't know, be with my head, you know, yeah. and then I've had time to just relax and do things that I hadn't had the chance to do in a long time. Like, like the stuff that I like to do, like make jewelry. Um, I've, I've been able to just sit there and not have to worry about having to do anything else. So that's fun. That's nice. Um, I have had problems with like procrastination. I mean, I always had procrastination problems, but with, with my schoolwork, like really, like I'm like, Oh, I'll do it like the way. And because I don't want to, like, it's, yeah. it's really hard to get myself to focus on that right now that we're in quarantine because I find all these other things to do. I, I say, Oh, look, I haven't organized this cabinet in a really long time. So I'm going to spend a whole five hours organizing this cabinet <laughs> and just my sense of time is really off. So I'm kind of scared for when we go back to normal that I'm going to be very confused on my time. Yeah. But I'm, I'm liking it. I, I do miss going out. Obviously, like I want to see people and I want to be out there in the world, but I, I like my house. Like I haven't gotten tired of it. Sometimes I'm like, you know what? I need to be away from my family. I need to not you know I shouldn't be here and like no don't talk to me but but it is nice to like be able to just go and be and have somebody to talk to there like I'm glad I don't live like alone, alone. or you know so that's true 
Yes, it's perfectly true. And this has changed my life too because I'm able to be more still. I'm able to meditate more, which I like, and practice that more, pray. Yeah. Just be more still and be in the present moment, I feel. I like that. Yeah, yeah. getting the time. Because in life, we, we're just so used to constantly going, you know? And and I think we should take it as, like, a like be thankful for it. Mm -hmm. I mean, I know it's not a great time. I know bad things are happening right now. But but we should also take advantage of the fact that, yeah, we, we do we get, have to, this so time. We get to. Yeah. And maybe get these habits of, of taking time for ourselves. And that way we can bring them back with us. So true. Yeah. So how you said, like, you don't want to do your schoolwork. Like, you kind of put it in the back burner. Do you feel like that's a sign? Yeah. Um. Yeah, I think this this not role like getting on this thing of like actually focusing on myself and being able to do things for myself. Now that I've started it, I want to kind of keep going, so I don't want to jump into school next semester. You know. Also, we don't even know if there's going to be actual classes next semester. So right now, what I'm thinking is I'm not going to register for next semester, just because I can't do online classes. They're, they're not my thing. Yeah. For those who can do it, I'm like, that's great for them. Um, but for me, I'm like, no, I'll just, I'll work if, if that's an option, or I'll just maybe write some music, write something. Write yes, something. do it, girl. That's awesome that you're realizing that, and it, it is a sign, and maybe you do need a break. Probably do. Probably do. I hate yeah. school. I, I hate school, but I still win. <laughs> I'm just kidding. So bad, but yeah. All right, girly. Well, thank you so much. And I do want to ask you something. What? You made up a quarantine song or something that you want to sing for us? <laughs> what? You, ask. <laughs> you don't have to. It's okay. Did I tell you that I made up a quarantine song? No, but did you? I could see you doing that. No. Did you? Oh. Did I? I feel like I did. I feel like I made one up and I recorded myself on Snapchat and I sent it out to friends, but... Oh, I made up a sock song. Okay, let's hear it. Do you mind? <laughs> no, but I don't have it, like, in my head. Ah. Like, that was just one... <laughs> like, one day, I was... Ha I had started the morning nights and early, and I was trying to pick out my socks, and I decided to sing a sock song. And I probably have it recorded somewhere. But no, I haven't written a quarantine song. <laughs> have no. you? Uh, I'm always singing randomly. I'm like, oh, I am going to put the shirt on. I'm like, I'm just so dumb. Yeah. Yeah. I think that makes everything so much fun. It does. To sing. I don't have, I don't have a sock song, but. <laughs> you want to make up a sing. song real quick? Like we would do at, at work? Like just be done. Yes. yes. I miss we were so creative. Like when we <laughs> would work together, how much fun. The time would go by so fast. Um, do you want to try it? Okay, Angela, darling, I will definitely start with. Oh, yes, we have to get in character. We have oh. to get in character. Have you drank your tea, love? Have you drank your tea? Oh, love. Oh, it's coffee. It's oh, it's coffee. coffee. Yes. No, it won't. It still goes good with biscuits. Oh, my gosh. Oh, no. Oh, my doggy. Oh, no. Bloody settle down, love. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's, let's start random. I don't know. For me now. We're stuck in our house. Stuck in our house Gonna get out To get some Quarantine snacks Aw oh, man Guess Oh fun. yes <laughs> You know I have to keep myself busy Or else I just keep eating all During this time You know Same That's all I want to do Have you tried the whipped coffee From TikTok No it's But good. I almost don't have TikTok it's Oh good. I'll show you how to, well, I can tell you real quick. One okay. tablespoon, one tablespoon a of tablespoon? hot water. Uh -huh. I don't think <laughs> I have a tablespoon. <laughs> one tablespoon. Okay. One tablespoon of hot water. Uh-huh. One tablespoon of instant coffee. Okay. One tablespoon of sugar of your, any kind. You put it on a bowl together. You whip it until it's whipped, <laughs> like whipped cream. And then you pour it over almond milk, milk, whatever of your choice. It's so good. I'll put it on Insta. I'll make a Oh, you pour it over? Yeah. Yeah, send it to me. So I'm going to forget that. Oh, <laughs> that sounds fun. I probably can't have it today because I'm already having two cups of coffee. Oh, that's true. Not good. Manana, girl.
coming, Anna. But thank you so much, Angela. I always have fun with you. You're and welcome. I always, <laughs> wait, tell me. Oh, uh, oh! I thought you were gonna say something. I was gonna say we should do it again. Yes. Because yes. I need to see your lovely face again, and also and we can we can really do this song thing. Yes, I'm down. But it's okay. Yeah. Uh, before you go, do you want to do like one random story, like just how fun it would be working together? It was just so random, right? Yes. Um. Okay. We had so many weird stories. Which one comes to your head? The one with the phone. <laughs> so okay, <everyone. laughs> we're obviously we work in one pod. So I'm here, Angela's to my left, and uh, we have to answer phones too at the same time while we're checking in people. <laughs> hello hello and if she hangs up she looks at me she's all do i have a boyfriend now like, <laughs> <laughs> and i'm like why are you saying that girl he called me sweetie like am i taken now or what no I don't know what came to mind. he called me babe oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. like all right thanks babe and i was like <laughs> are we dating <laughs> i didn't know <laughs> who are you <laughs> What's your name, love? <laughs> Call me back. Call me in 10 minutes. I'll be on lunch. <laughs> uh, yeah, that was a funny one. Were we checking in people at that time? Probably. We were always laughing. We're so oh, bad. No. Even with um, other co-workers, too. Like, yeah. Oh, with the bellman and with everybody. <laughs> oh, you want to say this? You laugh. Oh. I don't know if you were there that day. But I took like a video of him. He was just on the phone. You know that that phone on the corner where like the pilot sign in? Yeah. He was on that one for like five minutes. And he looks like he's talking to somebody. And then we're looking at we start we start paying attention to him. And he's just like, mm-hmm. Yes, sir. Oh no, yeah, it's doing great here. Like he's having a full-on conversation and he'd been there for way, way too long talking to yeah. nobody. He cracks me up. Oh, yeah. He would do that all the time. Oh, sir. Oh, yes, sir. What the Oh, <laughs> yes, sir. No, like of course. I'm <laughs> keeping this lobby so clean. I'm doing my job. Yeah. He's so hilarious. Front guess... desk. Front desk script coming at front you soon. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah. It's such a great job. More people should work at hotels. Well, that never makes... mind. Not if you're not good with people. But... <laughs> That's true. You have to be good with people. And a lot of good stories to tell. Yeah. <laughs> well thank you Angela for chatting with me and thank for being you, part Judith. of my little project <laughs> you're you rock. have fun today I'm so honored to be the first the first um person yeah my heart is warm <laughs> <laughs> I'm so happy darling all right girl yes, darling. well I'll let you go darling you have a good day now and you as well I will love you Goodbye. will Goodbye. Goodbye, love. <laughs> Goodbye. We'll talk soon. Bye. Toodles. <laughs> right. Toodles. Ta ta. Bye, girly. You leave or I leave. You leave. Go. Uh, we'll leave at the same time. Okay. One. One. Two. Two. Three. <laughs>